Ja počut vaška, vaš karakter, tvoj pogaška Brez jajca, ne strgam ti kao štjeki u na majca Karizme se ne može da učit, vaša pa imaš pravda This is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Review. I've always enjoyed queer cinema. The reason being, it's typically the story of people persevering against odds when everything is against them. As a black person, this is something I'm very much acquainted with, and I tend to like watching this in movies and other people's stories. But there's a problem, a fly in the ointment, if you will, namely, in some examples of queer cinema, like La Victor, there's this tendency to treat gay people as if they're these angelic beings who are cursed with loving another member of the same sex, and they're otherwise perfect people who do no wrong. I despise this portrayal with a passion because, and I speak for everyone when I say this, I've met some asinine gay people. Just because you're gay doesn't make you good, it doesn't make you kind, it doesn't make you understanding, it doesn't make you any of those things but human. That's why I like 2018's Consequences so much. It's about a person who is coming to understand their own sexuality, but the thing is, the movie doesn't portray him as a particularly nice person, because he's not. He's a liar, he's a bully, he is everything these movies tell us gay people aren't. And I love this movie for that because it tells you that to be gay doesn't mean you like fashion. It doesn't mean you like Lady Gaga. It doesn't mean you wear drag. It primarily means you love people of the same sex as you. That's it. The other shit is frivolous nonsense that's added on to it. For some people, those things are very valid. For a lot of people, they are not. And I get so tired of it being essentially foisted upon people that this is the way you should be. And with consequences, the lead character is none of these things. He is tough as fuck. He is strong. He is not at all what a typical quote-unquote gay person is. But he is nonetheless gay. And he is, as I said earlier, not a very good person. He starts off a not very good person at the beginning, and he ends up a worse person at the end. And keep in mind something. I'm not saying his story is a great one. And keep in mind something. I'm not saying at all that his story is a great one or one to be envied. What I am saying is his story is probably more typical than you think. His story is one of an ordinary person, a not very good ordinary person, I might add, who learns that he's not at all what he expected himself to be, what he imagines himself to be, what his community accepts that he should be. And he goes on being who he believes himself to be to the chagrin of everyone around him. In any case, Consequences is a great movie. It's also subtitled. I believe it's Polish. In any case, it's well worth watching. It's on Amazon, it's on Tubi, and it's a great movie. And the thing is, it's a great movie whether you are gay, you're not gay, you're not even sympathetic to it at all. It's a great, well-acted, extremely well-written movie about a person who comes to be something that he's been taught is not a good thing and how he responds to it. Check out Consequences. It's well worth your time. And this is Brian with ScreenFiles.com and Review. Do you agree? Disagree? Let me know down below. Peace and have a great weekend.